It is technology that RCA says will be used in the accounting of different cooperatives, whether it is for farmers, traders, and financial institutions such as SACO and various others. For example, one of the citizens, Naituriki Samuel, that we found in one of the SACO cooperatives sector in Kigali City, expressed the fact that he is registered in SACO that is located in the region of Rusizi, yet he works in Kigali City, and there is no technology that someone can use to link the two. It really affects him the fact that he can't receive services whenever he would like. Sometimes I need to send or withdraw money from my account in Wishenje Sako, but when I think that if I put it in the Kabeza Sako, it would be easier for me as opposed to putting it in my account in Wishenje. He says that if there is technology involved, it would be easier for him to receive savings and credit services anywhere, hoping that such services will be offered as soon as possible. My desire and hope is that they may link all the SACO cooperatives together. If you need to deposit money in SACO that is located in Kanombe, yet a person is stationed in another province, at least they would be able to see such a transaction without going through much trouble or having to add more money for it to happen. Nyiri Jira Willi is the Deputy Chief of Party Cooperative Development Program at Land O Lakes Venture 37. It is a project that has started training about 500 members of cooperatives in the use of technology, management and good governance, entrepreneurship, but with the aim of assisting in the efficient management of cooperatives and the development of its members through the use of technology. There is a goal to increase the trainings to at least three times in the next five years. According to him, this technology gives confidence in terms of good management of the cooperatives. It will as well help better the cooperative in terms of health so the members will have enough information about what he or she owes to the cooperative and the management of his or her shares. <laughs> Members often provide their harvest to the cooperative and then the cooperative takes it to a single market. Sometimes you find it is handwritten on paper which can be lost or can be misleading. We believe these programs and computers are going to be used to track such activities. It will also reduce the chaos that goes on in the preparation of reports and the monitoring of their work. This will help them to be aware of their productivity of a particular member who has been brought to the market, the money they have in the bank, what the members owe, which will completely change the image of SACO. The Director General of Rwanda Cooperative Agency, Professor Hadirima Najam Bosco, says there was a plan to reform the functioning of the cooperatives and use modern technology to solve the many problems faced by the cooperatives, especially in the mismanagement of assets and finances of its members, governance, and much more. <laughs> The aim is that poor management of cooperatives can be fixed, more so now that we have set up regulations that call on cooperatives to employ educated workers and they are definitely out here. Another thing is the road that we want to take leading us to choose a cashless economy can make us all use technology in both payment and performance-wise. The most important thing that we expect from this technology is for it to speed up the service, improve the management, and then make the management better because when the management is at its best, the person who invests through the cooperative is immediately impacted through it. The project is currently being tested on 24 agricultural and livestock cooperatives. It is expected that they will be provided with computers, that special programs will be developed for the management, and cooperatives within the next three months and then later on the same technology will be distributed elsewhere in the country. There are currently about 10,036 cooperatives in Rwanda with more than 5,300,000 members. The RCA says cooperatives want to use technology to manage their assets and members where there is a goal that at least in the next 12 months, most circles in Rwanda will be using it. Martina Abera, RTV News.